score a goal, get an assist. Um, what was your mentality going into the game? Uh, definitely a little bit of nerves. Um, my first MLS start, I know I had a, a couple minutes uh, against RSL and San Jose, but this was really kind of, I felt a big responsibility on my shoulders, just having to, to represent the depth that our team has. Um, obviously, Adi does a really good job week in and week out, and I didn't want the team to miss a beat at all. So I felt uh, a little bit of pressure, but the team was great. They had my back the whole time. Early on, not just finding my feet, I was making a lot of mistakes, but they kept supporting me, and eventually it, uh, I, I felt the rewards of, of that support, and I was really happy with the way the game went. What was it like uh, to score that goal? It was really exciting. Um, I actually, like, hey, hey. the game kind of slowed down in that moment, and I didn't really know what was going on. Uh, Normally, I'm pretty confident in my celebrations and what I'm going to do, but I completely blanked and didn't know what to do at, in that moment. It was pretty surreal. When you know what the depth chart is on a daily basis, as you mentioned with Hattie and Max, take us through sort of your own mind of making sure that you're still you know, ready to jump in there right at a moment's notice if you're needed as you do today. Yeah, I mean, the team is only as strong as kind of the backbone and, and the guys fighting for a spot on the bench even. So uh, I know that my role on a daily basis is to push the starters uh, regularly. And in this case, Adi was suspended, and I knew that the hard work that I've been putting in along with the team uh, would be rewarded today in this game. And that's the mentality of all the guys, whether they're starting or whether they're on the bench or just fighting to get onto the bench. We're all working really hard for each other to push the starters to make sure that they're ready for the game. And then if we have to step in, we know that we'll be ready as well. Caleb spoke a few moments ago about his conversations with you over the course of the round and making sure he stays connected with you. For you as the player being on the receiving end of that, what's it been like to from him? Yeah, his support has been unwavering, really. Um, first of all, allowing me to kind of take part in the U20 adventures. I think that was crucial in developing uh, kind of my craft and making myself more comfortable to play in MLS. The U20 World Cup was a big, big moment for me, and it provided me with a platform and to, to perform against a different different set of opponents and I think that I brought back a lot to to the team and for myself since I got back from Korea um, and then on, on a daily basis I mean he's always pushing me he'll be hard on me but he'll always tell me like he knows that I need to believe in myself and he believes in me and I think today showed. What do you take from this game knowing you know Audi's gonna be back Max will be back you might not get the start every week but you obviously showed that you can perform in the minutes. So. Yeah I mean I just need to be ready whenever I'm called upon. Uh, it's gonna be a long stretch moving into the postseason and we're going to need everyone. So, I mean, I can't, I have to keep working hard and just doing what I can to get on the field and just be ready to take my opportunities like I did today.